you know, people don't put put on YouTube and put up and you know for everybody to see and make them engaging. So uh, yeah, a lot of discussions I like to have. So I expect, and I know I know you're running the stream too. So mm -hmm. big plans for Smash on Tap beyond just watching people play. Yep. I'm going to do some interviews. I'm going to get rhymed for it. I'm going to get hopefully you know a lot of other top players from Toronto done coming up here, and we can learn a little bit more about the you know the story behind these players. Yeah, that's uh, for sure. Make them so more interesting. At the end of the stream, like uh, the tournaments, don't don't leave quite yet because we are going to be planning on having some like talks afterwards, like yes. uh, like maybe mini episodes of the players here, like 10, 15 minutes, not too long of your time to to learn more about these guys and, and what's going on in their heads. So exactly. Uh, How is it that they do what they do? Exactly. So, we have a fox and a sheik here today. K and Moki. Moki, uh, the fox, of course. And we just saw him putting in amazing work against Blitz. Yeah. So, now, this is that obviously, like, I think K is like a polar opposite to what Blitz is. Like, uh, K is more, uh, he's like a, a flow chart almost. Like, he's got, like, he's these, flow uh, chart. grab heavy. Grab heavy and just analyzing okay you're in this position now i'm going to go into this part of the flow chart and follow through yep so and he's very very consistent too whereas blitz is more like he's just uh he's just a wild animal <laughs> yeah blitz is more of a wild card so k doing a pretty good job so far he had a, a bit of a lead at the moment but quickly losing it yeah three words from Moki: don't get grabbed don't get grabbed exactly looks like it's happening right now Okay, good decision to forward throw him off because he knew he would not make it onto the stage to attack. Interesting. So, yeah, set up an opportunity to edge guard. Oh, Moki with these combos. Yeah. You can get a good grab right now. Nope. Take him off the stage for an edge guard. Ooh, oh, forward air. Oh, okay. This is the angle. One thing I always notice about K, he always nods. Whether he's losing or winning, he's always nodding. He's, he's the kind of guy. He's always yeah. he's always learning, and he's always you know he never gets salty about it really. Exactly. It's good. There's some players that nod. There's some players that uh, shake their heads. Right? Yeah, when players shake their heads, it's either that they're they're just like not happy with how they're playing, mm -hmm. or or even worse that they're not happy with how the game works or something. Like yeah, something stupid like that's like bullshit that. or something. Yeah, yeah. exactly. Like how do I get that phantom? Like a scrub mentality, you know? Yeah, yeah. But most of the time, you see that they're, they're more like displeased with how they play. They, they understood that, you know, like they made a mistake and they're, they're kind of beating themselves up a bit. Of course, nice shine. Denying his entry back onto the stage. I would assume Moki usually takes it. Oh, he's getting really good. Oh, though. no, that's a very dangerous. Yeah, yeah. If, if K just placed that back here correctly, he would have lost the stock there and it yep. would have been the game. Yep. Just okay. needs one clean hit, he could convert it. Uh, an up smash will take out Cheek at this point. Good edge guard will finish it off. That's it. Yeah. So I, I would say Moki usually takes this, right? And then I would say so, yeah. Um, but this it's looking pretty even, actually. Like, uh, okay, pretty yeah. good lot of work. Back throw, yeah. He got a little too eager with the down tilt. Give him an easy grab. Oh, he okay. gets hit by the Firefox. He had that pretty much in the bag until. He did. Case choking a little bit on the edge guards. Okay, good four tilt. But I don't know about that follow up. He sneaks right underneath him. Okay, good grab. Catch the roll. Okay, he anticipated a double jump uh, illusion. One edge guard. We'll take him out. That should be it. Yep. yep. Game one goes to Moki. Good stuff on Dreamland, too. Sometimes a counter pick from Sheik would be Dreamland, but. Moki. Well, Moki seems to like that stage a lot. Also a fan. All right, going to Battlefield. Good, Good decision. Making Even stage, it, I'd say. Yeah, making it a little difficult for Fox to recover low. So. Yep. Mm. Got the weird Battlefield sides there on the, on the, yeah. uh, the map. Okay, good crowd cancels. It looks like for a second he was about to change into Zelda. <laughs> <laughs> accident, I couldn't really tell. Okay. It's interesting to see a lot of players still go for that roll in, even at a high level. Like uh, K opting to, to roll inward. Yeah. Well, he didn't do anything about it, but... Sometimes you just don't expect it, right? And then, like, yeah. you, you're already committing to, like, a different uh, option. Oh, wow, and he just gets him with the needles. Is this Smash 4? <laughs> <laughs> oh, man, some Smash 4 sheet combos. Bunch of forward airs. 
bunch of forward airs and needles. That's really yeah. all the character is in Smash 4. And, there, and she's the best. <laughs> yeah. Especially when you watch Zero play or something. Okay, and... Alright, good back here to get herself back on stage. Get off me! Oh, there you go. Alright, and that up is going to take it. Keeping the stocks even. But she could take out the stock real quick. Yeah, one, one forward air. Or nair. Oh, uh, four tilt. I think he tried to do like a rising fair, but maybe he did the up tilt. Yeah. Instead. Or he just went for a hard read and didn't quite work out. Maybe. As he waited, could have got a grab maybe. Should be the stock. Try to get a little laser in, misses. Yo, Farzad is truth. I am the truth. The truth runs this stream. Without the truth, there would be no such thing as Smash on Tap as it is known. You guys would be watching something else right now if it weren't for me. You guys would be watching Smash on Lame. Smash that was a terrible on joke. That's horrible. <laughs> Ooh, up Smash. Lame on Tap. Lame on Tap. Sounds like Canadian beer. Yeah. <laughs> lame on Tap. Oh, man. Yeah, he goes for the, the up tilts over and over. Doesn't even punish. Okay, Moku. Up tilts are so dirty on Sheik. You get like literally anything off of it. Wow, that down tilt has crazy range. Yeah. Up tilts, down tilts. It's great, great poking devices. All right, and Moki with the lead here. This could be, this could be it. One clean grab. Oh, that was the biggest uh, mistake. Winner of this is uh, guaranteed uh, money. Oh yeah, yeah. We're, top, we're uh, top five payout today. We're already at the end of this tournament. Happened so quick. Well, it's winner semi, so winner of this goes into winner's finals. Damn. They're guaranteed uh, top three. We got 55 entrants here, so we got a little bit of a payout today, more so than usual. Oh, he knew it was coming. Quick air dodge into the stage. Pretty safe. I like okay. how he managed to get the SDI roll away. He's trying his best to escape from the grab combos and keep K on his toes. All right, uh, and he's got the, the tech chase here. Okay, this could be good for, for K here. Oh, what? Yeah, weird. It took longer. Yeah, I don't know why he turned around. I think maybe he uh, messed up his uh, reaction time there. Oh, the slow get up. I hate that when I forget. Oh, that's it. What a weird way to end that game. All right. I hate when I hate when your fox is over 100 percent, and then you just go on the, go for the regular get up on the stage, and you forget that it takes like twice the time. Oh my gosh, shit! Canadian beer is fine. I'm more of like a Heineken guy and, and a Guinness guy myself. So. I'm more of a straight shots kind of guy. Oh, that that works out too. We're talking about shots. You know, <laughs> JD. Yeah, JD. JD. I straight go for JD. Sailor Sailor Jerry's. Sailor Jerry's. Sailor Jerry's Kraken. Kraken's real nice. Oh, I love Kraken. Right? Kraken just came out of nowhere. I was like, what the fuck is that? Yeah. Like, the bottle's so fucking You just start sexy. seeing it at parties. You're like, oh, okay. Yeah. <laughs> it has a presence to it. I can fox with that. Yeah. I can fox with that. Nice. Speaking of fox, he's going to shine cheek right across the stage. Into <laughs> into getting into a grab combo. <laughs> into the death. Yeah. All right, good back here to get him off stage. And... All right, nice falling back here. Oh, okay. Like, Screws up the multi shine, but still gets the stock. Got a good like four or five before he left off the ground, though. So yeah. Not bad. Nice. Okay, good, good damage. Yeah. I think what he could have done, done is stayed on the ground and reversed and did an up tilt. Probably would have caught Sheik in her forward air instead of jumping. Like a lot of players seem to forget that you know, yeah, up smash can kill, but it's also a really good damage tool. Like it does so much damage. At low percents, up smash is great. Yeah. yeah. So you can still continue the combo, like right when she's at around zero. Stayed on the edge. Uh oh. Okay. You hang down to the ledge a little too long. I thought maybe Moki could run off shine. Yeah. Just gotta find a good time to steal it. But he's back on center stage. Great grab combo coming in. Now, this is all reaction from K. K's got some great, consistent reaction. Yeah, to look at that. Combos. He uh, he reacted to that roll. Yep. All right, dash attack and forward air. And I love that's going to that make quick work of Moki, but he makes it back on stage, <laughs> mixing up his recovery. Uh, he didn't go straight for it. So. Yeah, and he does the scrubby accidental slow get up into up smash death. 
Okay. So he was going for those shines. He didn't have to do all those shines. I think he might have been able to just finish it with an up smash. Yeah. Okay, and uh, Cave just uh, locking him down. Okay, and Shine Nair, he was trying to get that Nair, but yep. a little slow on the jump. Finish, finish off the stock. All right, and then Moki in a great position right now, but K, with all of this open space on FD, I think he can uh, get a few more of these tech chases. Definitely. Yep. If he can keep this up. It's a oh, great shoot. stage for those Sheik tech chases. He's got to keep Fox on his back on the ground. There we go. Fair? fair. Oh, fair. up air. Okay, oh, okay. I thought he was going to go for a fair to come off stage. Yeah. I think he's going for something stylish. He might have realized that, you know what, this Fox is a little too high, that the fair might not reach him in time. And he could probably just shine out of it. That or oh, he would needles. Oh, he could have got the next, he could have got the diagonal one. Okay, doing good work at just keeping Moki out of it. Nice. There you go. Just consistent. It's what's happening. Uh, just a uh, thing it disconnected for a second, but should be coming back real soon. I think the whole stream just now? Yeah, they, they're probably seeing it offline right now, but uh, yeah, it's going gonna, it's gonna to come back. It usually does that here now and then. But yeah, Oh, that down air. Whoa. Down smash. smash. He can't get oh, back he on. Doing it. He can't get back on. Oh, but he did. Now he's off stage. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, shit. That's it. Oh, wow. Oh, he grabs the edge. All he had to do is go right back on the edge. That's it. Oh, and Moki runs away with that. Really close game. Tight battle. Great job from K, keeping it really close. K, great work. Oh, not, 